got a very exciting subject to talk about. Today we're going to be talking about photography. Now I'm sure a lot of you are interested in photography and interested in how to take the perfect photo. We're going to talk to Habib Hussain. Habib Hussain started in the 70s. He was very, very interested in photography. He was able to become internationally known throughout his uh, cinematography. He's also a director. But today's uh, uh, the report is actually going to be about his first love, which is photography. We're going to learn more about that. I've got a very important question to ask him. So I hope you stay with us to get that answer. Okay, so we've got now we've got the chance to actually talk to Habib Hussain himself and we're going to ask that question that I was telling you about earlier. Uh, we're going to ask you Habib Hussain, uh, now you, I know that you're a director and you're internationally known for your films and the documentaries that you've done. You're also known for, um, right here in Kuwait, for um, documentaries that have to do with the environment. Now, all of a sudden I see this um, exhibition here and you're, you're focusing on photography and I know that you started with photography but you're kind of going back to it so my question to you is why? Um, well uh, during the 30 years of my work in filmmaking and photographing I had, a, I, had I can say thousands of photographs you know and it was on my archive you know and I thought why not show it to people? I just put it in the archive. So I decided to make a show, a photography show that called uh, Images, uh, which, which, which is a mix of different subjects. So basically, Habib Hussain, director Habib Hussain, you are mixing what you've done as far as a cinematography and filmmaking with this photography. You told me earlier, before we started the interview, that it's a kind of a mixture of your past work uh, your past cinematography work, but you've actually documented it through still photography. Photography, but you know that that uh, a film is a is a is a group of still shots, still shots. So when you when you when you know how to take a nice, well composed still shot, I think you will succeed and 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 uh, and and uh, photographing and being a, a cinematographer. So, uh, and as you said, during my, my uh, years of producing documentary films, I used to, you know, take photographs. So this is the uh, a collection, a collection of my photographs during all these years. Uh, Director Habib Hussain, now uh, there's a lot of people that are watching and they're, they're just starting. And they would like, of course, throughout your uh, answers, you've kind of answered me this question that I'm gonna, about to answer you, but I mean, about to ask you, but I also would like to tell you if there's anything you can tell the viewers about, the, especially the ones that are just starting, of tips on how to um, build a, a good relationship between them and the camera. Uh, the thing is, the, the main thing is, we have to enhance the people's uh, taste in, in in art in general, you know, not just in photography. Because art is life, you know. Art is a part of our life. Like architecture is art, uh, our clothes is art, our cars done by an artist, you know. So, but unfortunately, we in, let's say in Kuwait, we're not really taking care of this, uh, uh, this subject was the artistic, uh, uh, Seeing, seeing, seeing beauty, you know, uh, and this is very important to teach the the young kids about art and how how important art is in their life, in their future life. Of course, you have to train yourself. You, you can't say, "Oh, I have a good eye for photography," but you have to train yourself and learn the basics of photography. You're basically saying that before I hold the camera, you, I have to learn about seeing beauty in the object that I'm... You have to learn about the beauty and then take your camera and take photos of it. Yes, yes. It's good to, 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 
appreciate art, look at pictures, look at painting, learn why why he used this kind of color, why why he used this kind of angle, you know, why he used this size, a close-up or a wide shot, why? You ask the people who took this photograph or who, who painted this, and, and you're gonna learn, you're gonna learn, of course, you have to learn from the masters, you know, you have to re learn from the prof professionals. Then you have to take photographs and photographs and photographs, you know? And yeah, try and error. And of course, you have to, to learn the basics of photography. Like we said, the, the, the angles, the size of shot, what's, what's the importance of, of colors. We hope you found our report interesting and with our interview special with Habib Hussain. Now remember, Habib Hussain, the director Habib Hussain, reminded us about people who are especially trying to start with photography, that it's a good idea to build a relationship between the photographer and the subject, uh, to understand the beauty of that subject. It's more important than having a very expensive camera. Now, that comes with time, of course. You know, the more professionally you get, the more you will need better tools. However, the most important thing and basic thing is to understand the beauty and the, uh, the love between you and the subject. We're very excited that you stayed with us this, for this report. We hope to see you again with new reports in the future.